Hey everybody, Spirit here, back at you with Ian's Eyes, new indie title, uh, kind of like a horror adventure thing, stealth, <laughs> that's coming out September 1st, it's not an early access, this will be a complete game, a uh, very interesting concept, you play as a blind child's uh, seeing eye dog, uh, at his first day of school, and as you can imagine from some of the imagery, it's, it's a rough first day. It's not a very good game. I'm sorry to say it's got a really cool concept, but some some really poor design choices. Uh, I'll, I'll let the voice acting go. town in the northern U.S. It is celebrating the centenary of Blue No Home Primary School. Mm -hmm. Today, a new school year begins. This day is not easy for every child, especially mm -hmm. if you are the new boy at school, like little Ian. New people to meet, new places to explore. Uh huh. It would be simple if not for one small detail. What's Ian that? Oh, uh, yeah. Luckily, he's not alone. Mm -mm. His faithful friend North is always with him to be his eyes. And today, they will need each other more than ever. Classic. One of, one of the issues with this game is the voice acting. There's primarily two voices. Dad told us to ask her principal Bates. There's that kid who sound his voice. He's not bad. He's not a bad voice actor. He just sounds like he's um. He he sounds like Elijah Wood has been strained through a more annoying voice filter, uh, and that'll be showcased by one of the design flaws later. And then this uh, Captain Ahab looking motherfucker, who sounds like he was lobotomized. Uh, is he's not very good, and those are the two voices. Look at that dog; he's got a mouth like a stingray. That's North. That's me, I guess. That's who I'm playing. So here we go. You must be Ian. Welcome to Blue No Home Primary School. I'm Mr. Bates, principal of the school. It is an honor to welcome our first blind student. Our facilities are completely adapted to your comfort. Hello, Mr. Bates. Nice to meet you. What is your little friend's name? He's North. Come on, let me guide you around the school, Ian. This opening bit's got a lot of voice acting, and I'll just let it speak for itself. But uh, later on, it'll be pretty quiet. There's a lot of twins in this school, I just noticed. Uh, I like the the look of it, but there's this kind of low-fidelity weirdness. Uncanny. But not in the scary way, just in a, a bad way. See what Mr. Bates wants to show us. First, I want to show you the school map. Cool. If you get disoriented, there are braille maps everywhere. Now, touch this map. <laughs> now, touch this map. We're in this big dot, right? Yes, we are. This is heavy. This school is huge. Ugh. That's why there are maps all around the school. Cool. At a certain point, I had to mute these guys <laughs> um, because if you if you're dispatched, this little motherfucker will repeat the last line of dialogue every time, every time you screw up. And there, there's like quite a bit of trial and error, and error in this stealth game, trying to figure out the best way to avoid uh, enemies. And um, yeah, it's so it's if horrible. You already know, you can unleash your dog inside. North is very polite. But he gets a bit nervous when he's lost. North, search for another map, but don't go too far or disturb people. That is a lot of uh, requests for a dog. Be careful, North. Try not to disturb. Oh, anybody. shut up! Oh, a dog in the oh, I disturbed someone. Sorry. Here's here's uh, some stealth. Boom! Or he's a disc jockey. But I'll just sneak past my derriere in the air. Never trust the living. That's a uh, that's North. Where are you? And then he has the audacity to to flip out. Look, I'm back. Don't it worry. Took you so long. Being alone for too long scares me. Uh, I will guide you to And that's an element too. Okay. Let's go, North. Uh, I it's <laughs> it's just rough. This door leads to the car. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The next one is my office. Come, let's move on. Let us move on. 
I like his look. I like his crazy suspenders and his 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 Abraham Lincoln beard. His chin strap. Uh, in fact, you were in suspenders too. I guess yeah. This is this is the eighties, the age of the suspender. These big doors are the library. You can come here to read and study whenever you want. Cool. Can I go in there now? No. The uh, the classrooms are like there's a lot of assets. Uh, it feels like classrooms. Like it's it's good. It's just it's not good. It's only a dream. Oh, how much do you want to bet that's actually that's the developer's cheeky like? It turns out this is just a stupid fucking dream. That'd be horrifying. I haven't beaten this yet because I'm stuck at a place and I don't think I'm gonna keep playing because it's. I played. I played. Uh, I feel I'm. I'm very close to the end, and it's this just is not. This classroom, one hundred eleven. Open the door. Don't be afraid. It's not you the can first time. The room a bit if you want. Someone told me to open a door, and not be afraid. But uh, yeah, it's like it's just f so frustrating and not at all fun. Afterwards, meet your classmates at the gym. Thanks. The all right. I'll join you in a minute. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you for clipping through that wall, too. So, yeah, look, it's like a classroom. There's the water cycle and planets and the, the chairs. It all feels very, like, lovingly designed, but... <sighs> There's the bathroom. You find cassette tapes. Because, of course, you find cassette tapes to flesh out the story that you won't really care about all that much. There's some kind of... I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you're going to watch this and you're going to say, I don't know what this guy's talking about. That voice acting's great. This seems really fun. Uh, wait till you get to the stealth, though. We'll see. Maybe I'm just bad. Oh, wow. It seems that Mr. Bates has dropped something. But don't bark too loud. Okay. Um... What? Why, why is this happening? I'm barking for you, look! <laughs> Do I have to... Okay. Screw you! People can go to the place where the bark came from. See, it's showing you... All of the fun mechanics you, that we will learn. A tape! Luckily, I never forget my cassette player! The 80s... September the 1st, 1987. Leader Leon will arrive at the school in seven days, but the centenary isn't fully prepared yet. I hope the adjustments at the school are good enough so yeah, it'll be fine. your friend can move around in no time. Let's go to the gym. We're late. Mr. Lots of little... told us to be there as soon as possible. Be quiet, Elijah. Lots of fun little references, vote for manual. You know, like... A lot of love went into this, and that's why it's hard to say it's bad. But it's bad. It's not good. Be careful, North. Try not to disturb anybody. Yeah. It's just, uh... Mr. Bates told us to be there as soon as possible. Thank you. Here we go. If you go far away, bark loud. Come on, North. Reach the ultimate bark. North, be careful. Barking loud. Let's go in. Uh, uh, like <laughs> the ultimate bark scared him. Don't ask me to bark, then, you mother. Ah, here we go. Let's go, North. Let's search for a place to stand. <clears throat> Fifty years ago, students like you decided to fill this time capsule with several objects, objects considered important and worthy of being rediscovered in the future. Their future is now our present. Plus, Coca Cola is fine, but but we can't do Superman. How the school was like at that time. It was a bit less messy, of course. When we discovered the slides, there was a note saying, "The greatness of a school comes from its students and teachers." This is dedicated to them. This must be really good. They're not even blinking. 
Oh shit! What's going on, North? I want to get out of here. I'm scared. Something's wrong. <sighs> we have to get out of the school. So his his spider senses are tingling. He knows something's wrong. So we're gonna we're gonna get out. We are gonna get out of here. Oh boy. So we gotta, you know, they, because I think they're blind. I think that's what what's happening here. Um, move the girl out of your way with a bark. So yeah, that's. There you go. There's the main mechanic. Is like. Sometimes you're gonna have to move people out of the way. Sometimes, though, this game, why, why can't I go through? Um, will get s such narrow corridors that it, it's really a pain in the butt. And with this, like, I don't want to say the controls are um, uh, they're archaic, is what I'll say. And with the with the fixed camera angles, search for an exit, and let's go to the hall again. I'm sure we will find an exit there. I am sure we will find an exit there. Oh, this is rough. Okay, so we're going to take him back here. Drop him off. Now, the whole while I'm separated from him, you're going to see like a specter of death hanging over his head because he's freaking out. Come on. Oh, no! So, yeah, that, you know, you get, you get the idea. I... Have to lure these assholes away. Where do I want to go? There you go. I think we're good. There's the specter. But we're back, little Ian. Don't worry. Oh, what the hell is this? That was new. All right. Guide Ian to the entrance door. Oh, there's the map. Let's check the map real quick. Oh, no. Nope. Cutscene. Are we here yet? Thank you, North. Oh, no. It's locked. Let's wait. I'm sure someone is coming to rescue us. You are right, North. It seems that nobody is coming to save us. Let's find an exit. How much time passed? Like, did... Did he say, ah, oh, someone's coming, and then North barked, and he's like, ah, oh, you're right, this is fucked. Give up. The door is locked. We must find another exit. I know, Elijah Wood. I know. I know that the door is locked. Ah, oh boy. These cutscenes are really poor quality, too. Uh, intrigue. Uh, this noise may come from Mr. Bates's office. This noise may come from Mr. Bates' office. Oh, jeez. This noise may come from. Thank you. See, that's that's the problem. Every every time you get to that one of those checkpoints, he repeats the last bit of dialogue, and that's real rough. <laughs> that's real frustrating. To me, anyway. Maybe, maybe it's just because I die more. Oh, jeez. Come on. Where's the redhead? Come here. Oh, f this is not where I wanted to lead you guys. Okay. No, they're still too close. <sighs> oh, and they reset. All right, boy, this is a pain in the ass. Come here. Oh, these controls are so rough. This way. Oh, oh. <sighs> Come here. <laughs> oh, he didn't. He didn't repeat the dialogue this time. That's strong. 
No. Can't get away very quickly. If you couldn't tell, because the controls for mouse and keyboard are the uh, directional pads, which I think it's the same case for the controller. I haven't tried. This noise may come from Mr. Bates's Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Oh, come on. Come on. Okay. Oh, no. Oh, shit. It, lo it, it shouldn't be this difficult, should it? This noise. Thank you. This noise. Come on. You right hear me like just. Oh, no, don't go. No, you. Jesus. <sighs> All right, focusing my chi. <laughs> this noise make yeah the noise the noise the noise oh the noise oh my goodness. All right, I don't remember this giving me this <laughs> this much trouble the first time. This noise may come from uh oh come on, come here, come here. Not you, not you. They're blind, but boy, if you're remotely this in proximity to them. Mr. Bates's office. Like, it's one thing if you're running past him. Fine, I understand then. No, no, you. It's the redhead that's giving me trouble. I want to get them both out of there because you, can, you I can't walk past them. I'm too close. I'm too close. Come here. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Go. 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 Okay. Whew. That's not it. Hey, look. There's a poltergeist thing. Cool. But we made it to Principal Bates' office, where the noise was heard. What? What's happening, North? Help me! Relax, boy. I'm Principal Bates. <laughs> Thank God you're safe. Something terrible has happened. No shit! The students and teachers are acting really strange. It's probably you! We must get out as fast as we can. Quick, come into my office. But the front door is locked. Now we are in trouble. Well, the emergency doors are in the gym and the cafeteria. The gym is impossible. So we Everyone in this game upstairs. is a mouth breather if you if you watch their mouths. The safest way to go upstairs is through the library. Fun fact. That's why I need you. I've left the library key at bathroom 101. I've tried to pick it up before, but mm -hmm. I'm not up for these things anymore. I'm sure you and your dog won't have any problems bringing it back. <laughs> Leave my office. Go right, and you will find hallway A. The bathroom is located between classrooms 101 and 102. Don't waste your time. <laughs> Let's go, North. I trust uh, you. Don't waste your time. That's what I'm talking about. Like, this guy was clearly lobotomized. Maybe that's his character. Maybe that's his deal. But also, what principle would endanger a child? A blind child on his first day at a new school, like, fine, maybe he's very familiar with this school. It's his first day, like, oh, go to the library. Go take care of this for me. I'm old. I can't do this. No principal would do that. Also, look at my weird... Look at that. Oh, it's hideous. <sighs> bye. Bye. Goodbye. Oh, look, he's got the Odyssey, Fahrenheit 451. He's got some good books there. The Hunger Games. Uh... I don't know what the Hunger Games is doing next to the Odyssey in Fahrenheit 451. I'll tell you that right, right now. Oh, look at her. Moby Dick, Harry Potter, Frankenstein, <laughs> Jules Verne's, Twenty Thousand Leagues Under the Sea, where the wild Leave things are. Leave my office and go to bathroom 101. It's on the right, near classroom 101. He locked me out. Ah. <sighs> Okay. Oh, jeez. No! Shit. See? That's what I'm talking about, trial and error. Shut up. Um, how am I... With the fixed camera angle, how am I supposed to know she's coming? Leave my office. And there it is. How come every time I die, I have to... Like, I, I didn't forget. I didn't forget what you told me. I promise. 
I don't need to hear it again. Bathroom 101 is between classrooms 101 and 102. I'm guessing it's this way. Based on this enemy. Uh, how did he... No! Oh, no! See? Are you kidding me? Bathroom 101... Shut the fuck up. And and somebody will say, you can skip. I could. I could even put it on mute. It shouldn't be an issue. It shouldn't be happening. Is my, what I'm saying. No! Mother... Bathroom 101... It's not like... There's no option. I don't get to say, eh, I don't want that. Please. There you go. Okay. We're working on it. We're working our way back to you, girl. You want to you get a soda pop? Look, somebody put run graffiti identical parallel. That's interesting. Also, what are these gross white stains? I bet evil. Maybe it's like the Strigoi from The Strain. Hey, that show's disappointing as fuck. I hope I'm not saying something too, um... Too controversial, but I'm pretty sure it's bad. Oh, no! Bathroom 101 is between classrooms... Like, so I'm past, obviously, that earlier checkpoint. He still repeats that dialogue. I don't want to hear it anymore. I know. I, I Trust me, man. I haven't forgotten. Oh, Christ. Jiminy Christmas. Let's go. No! Oh, shit! <laughs> what am I supposed to do there? Uh, 101 and 102. Yeah, 101 and 102. Are you sure? Maybe I'll just... Well, I'm over here. Come on. No! Oh, are you... Sh okay. Okay. Yeah, the teachers follow more aggressively, but they appear to be... Like, there's some differences in designs. And fortunately, they don't reset. Do they say it's in 101 or 102? Oh! Definitely not 102! <sighs> so, yeah. I don't think this is very good. I wanted it to be. It's an interesting concept. And it's a, it's a right shame. Stay away from my boy. From my home slice. No fucking... Oh, please. Where... Is she still following? Are you... Fuck off. Like, how far are you going? Okay, alright, alright. Alright. I'm, I'm like, it's like I'm back in Nam. Come on. Fun little tidbit. Nor North was in Nam. Not for the conflict, he was just there. Okay. There you go. Alright. Definitely not going back in 102. That's bad, bad touch. Hey, look, Gremlins. Did you like that movie? The developers did. Okay, here we go. There's the bathroom. But, like, look at this. This is a. Uh, if. I will say, things went real bad real fast. I don't know why the classroom is in such a state when five minutes ago this happened, but yeah, I'm, I'll, I'll suspend my disbelief, but uh, I, don't, I don't know. Let's go to the back. Sure the library key is around here somewhere. No! In here? There you go. Take it. We did it. This must be the library key. Mr. Bates will be very happy. Let's go back to his office as soon as possible. Okay. Something's happened in the hallway. I don't like it, North. Something is happening in the hallway. I don't like it, North. This little guy's like Daredevil. Like how? How did you know? To be fair, I'm not blind. So I'm not sure. Maybe maybe it's that acute, but like, wow. If I heard a loud noise, I'd be like, where did that noise come from? This guy knows. He's got it on point. He's like, it is in the hallway. I don't like it. Oh, God. So yeah, enemies are on patrol. What was that move? That's I think that's, yeah. 
That's her pathing. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, that's the ticket. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. No! <sighs> like, oh, this is real rough. Shit like this, it's not fun, developers. Maybe there's like a stealth enthusiast that's just gonna go ape shit over this game, but I, I really don't think so. I really do not believe that anyone is going to enjoy this. <sighs> Blessedly, there's no dialogue for him to repeat, so I don't have to listen to his whiny Elijah Wood voice. Because if that were the case, I'd just... I'd just go nuts. Alright. We, we're, we're dancing a very... Ooh. Okay. Okay. Whew. All right. Oh no! What the heck? No! What the hell is that? Like, think on your feet, Jake. I don't wanna. I don't want that. All right, I'm gonna turn. Boom. Now what? He is following pretty aggressively, though. Uh, can I go in here? No. It must be this room. No? So I'm just gonna die, huh? Nope, no, he screwed off. Oh, there's the principal's office. Enchantment under the sea. Hey, did you guys enjoy the film um, Back to the Future? When Mr. Bates comes back, we'll be able to go home. Another cassette tape. Which story will it tell? Maybe Lord of the Rings. April the 5th. 1980. It's been a month since our baby left. It is said that you only die when you are forgotten. In every corner of the school, there is a piece of him. The maps, the inscriptions, everything was made for him. As long as I'm alive, he will be alive too. It's pretty morbid leaving a piece of your kid all over this school. It seems that Mr. Bates is not coming. There must be another exit, Nor. We got the library key. <laughs> he jumps to conclusions so fast. He listens to that cassette tape. A minute hasn't passed since he came in here, and he's like, I guess this motherfucker just isn't coming. Maybe he is. Maybe he's coming. Maybe you're impatient. Oh, boy. Let's look at the map. There are we. I, I don't even know where I have to go. I don't even know where I have to go. I don't give. I don't Did care. You hear that, North? I'm sure that Mr. Bass is locked inside that room. And you know this is cheeky of the developers because they're like, hey, let's just put a fail state. Let's just let's just be annoying. Oh no! And it, it seems that Mr. Bass is not. Yeah, thanks for that again. I forgot. But this this time. He knows. He knows in a past life he was killed. I hear footsteps approaching. Do you? No, no! <laughs> okay, that was a f hint. And I, I should. Footsteps. Thank you. Although, uh, yeah, whatever. Whatever. I'm gonna go this way, I guess. I, you know, that was fine design. You know. I hear footsteps approaching. Like, okay, you gotta get out of dodge. That's fine. Come on. Ah! <sighs> ah! Oh boy, this isn't good. <laughs> oh, I've gotten myself into quite I'm a pickle. Sure we can reach the library this way too. <laughs> oh, <laughs> the game just decided to give it to me. All right. Oh no. Oh jeez. There we go. I'm pretty sure we can reach the library this way too. Yeah, we can. Uh huh. I'm pretty sure we can reach the library this way too. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure we can reach the library this way too. Uh, 
I'm pretty sure we can reach the library. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we can reach the library this way too. Oh, it's bad. Okay. <laughs> Uh, what the hell is that? Uh, oh, this is, oh, this is rough. Okay, all right. Um, you park it there. Oh, he's probably going to get killed. This might be where it ends. I remember this was my first major roadblock, is getting these two assholes in such a way... No, North! I mean, Ian! I'm pretty sure we can reach the library this way, too. <sighs> I'm being qu I'm letting this wash over you, if you can't tell. I'm being... This is artsy-fartsy right here. I ultimate barked those bitches. Come on! No! Oh, fuck it. Die. Go on. I'm pretty I'm sure, pretty we, can sure we can reach the library this way, this way, too. This is, um... This is Ian's eyes. I don't know what it's gonna cost. Let's... Uh, it could be five bucks, it could be ten bucks, and if they're real ballsy, it'll be more than that. I think it's gonna be five, ten dollars. Love the concept. The art is really cool. Albeit a little, um... Got a little weird low fidelity kind of thing too, which is a shame. I think the gameplay is is just too frustrating. Between the fact that the the, the fixed camera angles and the frequency with which you'll die, and the fact that he's going to repeat the last bit of dialogue every time you die, it's just going to drive you nuts. It's driven me insane. I'm there. I'm nuts. Um, it's a, it's a good effort, and I hope the developers. You know, do another thing, and they take this experience, and they and they and they polish this really unfortunate turd, make something better. But as it is, this this is not good. This is not fun. It's, it's just frustrating and bad. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you liked it, like it. If you disliked it, dislike it. Comment. Start a conversation. You disagree with me, and you want to make some points. You do that. And uh, and if you enjoyed the video, subscribe and all that all that good shit. So thanks for watching. Catch you next time.